and this is Morgan and today we're going to show you guys um, a nail tutorial that's um, pretty different. Super simple though. Yeah, it's really really easy and it's going to be using gel pens. Well, this white gel pen and I got this in a um, little set back when I was going back to school last year and these are from Office Depot. Um, most likely any gel pens should work. Mm -hmm. um, so yeah, we're going to show you how to do two different things. Do you want to show them? Yeah, we're going to show you how to do like a checkered print. Now I did my ring finger, but a checkered print. And then I'm going to show you how to do these um, zebra nails. So yeah, it's really super easy. And also, well, I don't know if you guys have heard, but um, I'm sure many of you know about IMATS, which is the International Makeup Artist Trade Show in L.A. And um, it's already gone. It's, this year's has already happened, but next year we're trying to get there. And I don't know also if you guys are aware with press passes. Yeah, um, well, we talked about this a lot on Twitter, but in case you don't follow us, well, you should go follow us, but that's why we're explaining this, but <sighs> press passes, uh, you, if you get, like, 25,000 subscribers, you can get press passes for IMATS, which basically allows you to, like, film there and stuff, I think, and so, and there's a lot of other benefits associated with those, but our parents, um, won't, it's since California is really far away from us and everything, um, and it's going to be really expensive to go. Our parents won't actually take us unless we get press passes. And we really, really want to really go. go to IMATS. <laughs> yeah, we, we watch so many IMATS videos all the time. And we really want to go. So um, if you guys could help us out in any way with, like, shout-outs on Twitter, YouTube, anything. Um, that would be great. Or if you're not subscribed to us right now and you're watching this video, um, we would really appreciate it if you subscribed to us. Because we really want to get to 25. Yeah. <laughs> But we have till April, so we're working yeah. very hard, and we have goals we reach each day, so we're going to be trying to do that, and we're yeah. on our way. And also, um, we both just got white iPhones. We've been saving up for them for ever since we got started our YouTube channel. We've been saving up for these. Mm -hmm. And so what we were thinking is we might do a um, an iPhone channel where we just, like, upload random videos. And we asked a couple people on Twitter, but like we said, if you don't follow us on Twitter, you wouldn't know. But just leave in the comment below whether you would want us to make an iPhone channel just with random stuff. It would be totally, like, not formal like this is or anything. Yeah. Like, we only do, like, one video a week or so on this channel, and it would just be, like... Video every day and just, like, our lives. <laughs> well, maybe not every day, but it'd but, just be, like, anything that we feel like is worth filming, we would just yeah. video. Yeah. So just let us know in the comments below. Also, we want to give a shout-out to... Um, Sammy Davis Vintage uh, here on YouTube. She has a Twitter and I think she has like a blog. Um, I'll try to link everything below. But we were messaging her on uh, from our YouTube channel and because I had a question for her, and then she responded and she was so sweet. First of all, answering my question and everything. Um, and then she asked us. She's really into like vintage fashion. It's the name Sammy Davis Vintage. <laughs> and she just um, like the first time I talked to her, she offered to send us some vintage scarves. And so this is what ours look like. This is one of them. And this is another one. And I think she said these were from the 60s and 70s. And Sydney got two, but Sydney's on vacation right now. So. Yeah, Sydney's not here right now. But um, this is what mine looks like. And then the other one looks like, oh, thunder. <laughs> and then the other one looks like this. And so I just all... want to say a huge thank you to her because that's, yeah. that's like so sweet and yeah. like, generous. I don't know how many people would actually like offer to give someone something the first time they ever talked to them. So. Yeah, and so it was really sweet and we really love them. So we just want to say thank you for yes. that. Yes, and all of you guys should go subscribe to her. So. Yes. Okay, well, here's our tutorial. Yeah. Okay, so the first look we're going to be doing is checkerboard nails. And I'm just going to be doing my ring finger just because, I don't know, I think it looks cool if you just do one. For this look. Okay, so it's really simple. So first of all, you want to take your, find your ring finger. And I just painted mine black. I just used um, an NYC, their black paint, and just put top coat over it. And so what you want to do is you want to start by drawing three lines, or lines across up to the top. And we're using a white gel pen, but you can use any gel pen, and you can also use any combination of colors. You don't have to use black or white. Then you're going to draw vertical lines. Okay, so that is, um, and like right here you can see they're a little bit closer together. Over here they're farther apart. Kind of looks like Spider-Man right now. But that's step two. Okay, and then you're just going to go um, diagonally and color the ones that connect from corner to corner. I mean, I guess all of them connect from corner to corner, but just start in one corner and just go diagonally down. Okay, 
and that's basically what it's going to look like. This one, these are a little bit smaller than these, so you can do it either way. And you can do lots of different patterns and designs, but that's just a really simple one. And then you want to do top coat because since it's gel pen, we're just using the Stella Hanson top top coat. Um, you can use any top coat, though. but you definitely want to use a top coat because since it's gel pen, it will wash off. And that basically seals it. All right, so I'm gonna be showing you how to do um, the zebra pattern. <laughs> so, okay, so first you're just gonna paint your nails black. Um, I use this Sally Hansen um, blackout nail polish, and then you're gonna take um, your gel pen, and we're going for kind of like a zebra look, even though I'm pretty sure zebras have like are like white with black stripes, but I don't think they make black gel pens, or at least I can't find any. So you're just gonna start drawing um, stripes on. Like so. They don't all have to look exactly the same. Obviously. Okay, so this is what it should look like. And then for the last step, I'm going to be taking um, the Sally Hansen top coat or any kind of clear nail polish or top coat will be fine and just seal it in just like Brooke did so that it won't wash off. Alright, thank you for watching and we hope you um, liked this and just quit pick us a picture if you guys did this or leave a video response below. So if you have any other nail tutorials that you would like to see, please just leave a request below and we'll definitely try to get on those. So yeah, thank you for watching. Thank you for watching.